Hi everyone, this is Ista Ra with a message for you today. So I, um, I want to leave a quick message. Unfortunately, my new computer, so I've had, as you all know from previous messages and stuff, I had issues with my computer. Uh, my old computer is gone. Um, I have a new computer and I used the video thing at least three times today and lost sound. First, I had no picture. We figured that out, got it fixed, and now there is no sound. So I'm not quite sure what's happening. I apologize for uploading videos that did not work. Um, so I just wanted to give you a heads up that I'm a little behind in getting out video readings to people. So those of you who have them, you're on my list. Those of you who I sent one that didn't make any sound, I apologize. I will redo yours. Can't guarantee you'll get the same reading because clearly my brain... Um, doesn't remember what I'm saying at the time, as we all know, I'm not exactly, you know, memorizing it or writing it down, it is a channel. So I just want you to have that heads up and understand that. I also wanna let you know the energies are really crazy right now and um, we are in the middle of closing, ending, things are just, it's that it's done, it's almost done is what I feel. Which um, leads us to very quickly, a very good new moon energy coming in and I actually did a reading and I duplicated the reading in my second video and guess what? It didn't have sound either and the reading was awesome. Really, really good stuff and so the gist of that quick reading, very shortly, very simple, the gist of that reading for this week, um, October 27th, 2016, was the fem divine feminine, I remember this, I remember this distinctly because I recorded it three times. <laughs> um, and of course, the first time was probably the best, most profound one. Um, the, let's see, the divine feminine energy is all about the divine feminine opening up her heart to fully express herself and express her love. And the divine masculine is, be is he is opening his heart to receive, to begin to like make a space from his heart so like he actually will make decisions and guidance through his heart chakra versus his head which is a huge change big difference i'm so excited about this um also the fine the um union the reading for the union i've got to remember the cards i can see them in my head the reunion um it showed that our heart is being brought back to us and so what's interesting to me is it's like a soldier tin man on, on a horse and there's like an open chamber at his heart level but there's a bird coming in with his heart hanging there and he's bringing it and so to me spirits bringing us our heart bringing us our love bringing us our twin bringing us our union it's coming it's now and so what's funny is my guides as I was recording several times, I kept hearing, it's now, it's now. So I don't know if it's now means tonight. I don't know if it's, if na it's now means yesterday. It's now meaning tomorrow. It's now next week. I don't know, but I just know it's now is what I'm hearing. So it gives me hope and optimism for our beautiful unions because I feel like they're not far off. On the surface, it ain't looking pretty. <laughs> I can tell you that after all the problems I've had with my computer this week, I've had some back issues. I'm really tired. Um, and I feel really bad about posting videos that just can't be seen. Um, so I just wanted to um, quickly give you an update about where I am, why my, my computer's not working. I'm hoping to get my video stuff up and running so I can do some more videos for you. I'm doing this on my cell phone, but I have to tell you, it's not very comfortable. My back hurts and my arm being extended out like this is not comfortable for me. So I won't be doing videos like this too much, I don't think. Um, I also wanted you to know that we are in a really good place and I'm hoping by Sunday I'll be able to do a new moon um, video for all of you so that you know I can get that message out but in the meantime I just I'm really being strongly guided to encourage you to stay in your heart trust everything that you can um, use everything every tool that you have at your disposal to send love to yourself and to your twin and here's what's interesting so yesterday I went to a store and I was buying a couple um, long sleeve shirts for the winter because I really need clothes badly um, and I don't have anything really warm and I needed something warm so 
I was trying on something and I found this really cute long sleeve t-shirt I did not buy because I thought, oh, I don't want to waste money. But I had to grab it and try it on because it was cute. And the reason I'm sharing this with you is the shirt said, truly, madly, deeply in love. And that's exactly how I feel about me and my beloved. I totally feel truly, madly, deeply in love with him. But the truth is, over all this time, I've never fully expressed that to him. I never got to. I never had the opportunity to truly say to him, this is how I feel about you. This is what I want you to know. And I feel like he's never been able to receive it. And I've never been at the place where I could do it. And now I feel like that's a huge sign. And now I want to go back to the store and buy that shirt. And I might go back to that store to buy that shirt. Um, although there was only one left and it's not likely going to be there. But hey, if I'm meant to have it, I'm going to have it. And I promise if I do get the shirt, I will take a picture so you can see it. Um, but I, I think that that is the essence of the reading for the week is we are, we as a divine feminine are getting ready to like open our hearts fully and sh express and show our love. And I feel like that means out loud, you know, letting people know that we're twins, letting, letting people know that. I love this person and no matter what anybody else may think, no matter what the world universe gets, I am in love and just kind of being in that love. And actually what's interesting when I'm talking, I feel like that means manifestation because the more you're in that love and the more you're feeling that love, the more you're going to express and the more you're going to enjoy. And guess what? That means you're manifesting it, you're manifesting it. You're making it happen. And then, um, the other part, just bringing it back up. So me sending